This model is showing how a human spine forms in an embryo. This process for creating body segments like vertebrae is known as somatogenesis. But while it has been studied in animals like frogs or mice, it remains difficult to observe in humans. But now, this new model is offering scientists a glimpse of this crucial developmental step. Studying the development of human embryos is very difficult, both technically and ethically, with strict rules governing the use of embryos in research. This new model, which the researchers call an axioloid, aims to get around these problems by creating a surrogate for an embryo in a dish using human pluripotent stem cells. To build the axioloid, the researchers exposed stem cells to chemical signals which triggered them to differentiate into various embryonic structures. One by one, they introduced different signals before embedding the cells into a scaffold called a matrigel a carefully constructed matrix of proteins like laminin and collagen. By mimicking the factors which influence the transformation of stem cells into embryonic cells, the team can model what happens in real-life embryo development. What starts as blobs of cells begins to grow and differentiate into structures, forming segments and symmetry in a coordinated way. In essence, this is the process of somatogenesis, where lumps of tissue start to form in pairs along the length of an embryo. These lumps could then go on to form the spine, as well as lots of other tissues which make up body parts, like muscle, cartilage and tendons. Modelling this process could give scientists a new platform to study human development and disease. For example, it has been suggested that disorders like scoliosis might be linked to problems during somatogenesis, and the researchers were able to model this in their axioloid disrupting somatogenesis to demonstrate features of various congenital diseases of the human spine. The authors say their approach shows that complex developmental processes can be broken down into their fundamental building blocks, and their axioloids give them a platform to better understand and even manipulate these developmental events in minute detail.